This is the eighth edition of Industry Night, and I'm here with a Grand Prix record. Yes, the one and only Renee. Very beautiful girl. She's on Fimboya Tattoo, and she's here to share her two cents on the Kenyan music industry. What do you think of the Kenyan industry right now? Well, I think we're growing. I think, uh, okay, we started off very well. Then somewhere along the way, we became a bit slower. Other countries came back and overtook us. But I think right now we are starting to catch up and we're doing pretty well. How long have you been in the industry? <laughs> oh my gosh, okay, for real? I've been a fan for since when I was born. <laughs> But I've been an actual artist for around one year. Yeah, actually, all right. I actually released my first single exactly uh, one year ago. Wow. Wow. Yeah. Wow. So you're a pretty new uh, female yes. musician. Yes, yes. Have you faced any opposition as yet? One thing I can say about female artists, we don't actually face opposition, but um, it's a matter of your drive, yeah? People are willing to get, so many people offer you chances to do so many things, record, do videos for free. So it's just a matter of you knowing which options you need to take and where you need to go with your music. So I can't say there's any resistance, but I can say it's a matter of uh, drive. Okay. Yeah. Being one year old in the industry, uh -huh. who are you hoping to work with from Kenya or from East Africa this year? Oh my gosh. Um, First of all, the people I start, I, I was really wishing to work with, I already did, from YNA yeah. to Visita. That was like a dream come true. Yeah. Then I think I can move onwards now to Matrax. I totally admire his flow, his lyrical content, his style. I think he's one artist I would really like to do a collab. Matrax, do something. Please, <laughs> I beg you. <laughs> this is me begging you on yeah. national TV. Yeah? Matrax, yeah, yes. Maneno. <laughs> But anyway, um, if it's East Africa, I think from Uganda, I'd like to do something with Eddie Kenzo. I think he's young. I think we can fuse together very well. And he's coming. No, he's not coming up really fast. He's already made it. Yeah. So he's such an example to me. And I think our styles would do well together. Yeah, that's why. Um, what else? Right now, though, uh, being one year in the industry and being a fan for forever, like I have been, what do you think of the music industry right now? Are we at par with our counterparts in Uganda, in Tanzania, in the whole of Africa? Okay, first of all, you've been around for forever, that's a lie. For forever? No. Forever, girl! No! <laughs> you look too young. Rudy Nyumba. You look too young. <laughs> okay, let me stop. But seriously, I think we need to stop comparing ourselves to other people. We all have talent. Every country, from the Tanzanians to the Ugandans to the... West Africans to the South Africans, North Africans, we are very diverse. So you really, it's not fair to start saying, are we doing as good as Nigerians? But what I can say is, we have a lot of improvement to do in our industry. From every single practice, right from recording, to the kind of videos we do, to the type of distribution we do, the type of packaging we give our artists, the audience need a lot of, um, let me say, not brainwashing, but they need to change their mindset about the music we produce. So there's a lot of things, there's a lot of dynamics involved in improving our industry. But I think we should just stop comparing. Like everyone, every child grows at a different pace. Yeah. Let's just take it as we can yeah. and move on from there. Good point. Yeah. Um, what is your inspiration? There's nothing as inspiring as seeing a fun enjoying your music to me that's the most ideal thing i'm an entertainer it's my job to give good music good entertainment to the fans yeah so for me my inspiration is the fans if they're not enjoying it then i actually end up feeling you know like a bit self-conscious like am i doing the right thing am i not so to me it's all about the fans if they like it we move on if they don't i go back to studio and i do something else all right, yeah. and as we expect uh, more music from you this year, yeah, I just want to ask, yeah. what tips, I need you to give me like five tips that you would give to people, this is actually away from the music, to have a glamorous look as yourself. Yeah. <laughs> Everyone. Say? Yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm putting you on the spot. It did not start like this, let me tell you. Thank God I started last year after I had a bit of footing with my fashion because I, I made a lot of mistakes. I made a lot of mistakes. So what I can say, okay, let's go with five, yeah? Five, um, no 
know yourself, know your, know what you like. Yeah. Yes, you can't. I can't do a hairstyle like yours and think I look good. And I this is for me, girl. Exactly. You rock it with more confidence than I will. Yeah. So, for real, know yourself. Secondly, um, know your body shape and what it goes with. What, what do I need to say? Let's just turn around for the yeah. camera. We're all fearfully and wonderfully made. Some say more fearfully than wonderfully. Yeah. But anyway, <laughs> um, uh, just know your body size and what suits you. Third, confidence. You, Whatever you have on, whether it's good, work, sad, or nice, like you need to wear it with confidence, you know? You can't just walk around pulling your skirts down and yeah, everything, yeah? Exactly. Fourth, occasion. Don't go dressing like this in town. Seriously, or like this. You will be stripped. Exactly. You will be stripped. You're asking for it. So just know the appropriate, or in church, yeah. know the appropriate places to wear certain things. And lastly, I think skin is the most important thing. Yes. Wear what suits you. Like, don't go wearing different colors that don't suit your skin type and all that. So I think top of the head, those are the points that I have. Wow, yeah. thank you so much. That was thank wonderful. You. This is Renee, the one and only. Let me do a little acapella. Yeah. Somebody ring the alarm. This time Kunamoto, we on fire. Oh Lord, oh, mercy, 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 ni Rene. Thank you so much for having me. You're watching Industry Night. Peace.